Houndsman mast to my um, signal keeper antenna. This is the bottom of the signal keeper antenna, so the main part, the main upright of the antenna goes here. We've got some radios come out here. Yeah, three radios. Yeah. What I noticed was that a piece of waste pipe, yeah, just from your DIY shop, um, happened to fit into the end of that quite nice. Yeah. So I thought that was good. There's maybe different sizes, sorry, there's maybe, maybe different sizes of this, so you'd have to check your measurements. I just happened to have a bit of tube in my garden when I had my area and my antenna out, and um, I just noticed, I just noticed it fitted, so that was rather good. So to fasten it onto that, I drew two holes, one there. I want that to match where the two little grub screws, sorry, where the two little grub screws go. There. So I can put that on and fasten the grub screws and I'll hold that on. Now, the coax for this goes in the middle here. So I had to make a hole side of this little section that I cut, which we got now, make a hole so I can push my, that's a bit big enough for the coax connector to go through, yeah, like that, that can then connect onto that. solid on there. That's a good connection. Now, <coughs> so the rest of my antenna, my upright goes that way, my radios come off that way. I'll show you this that soon. Now, I'll put that to one side for one second. This is the top piece from the Klansman uh, mast. Uh, the rest of the mast goes off this way. This is, I assume, the original Klansman wire antenna, which hangs down, and there's a plug at the end of it, somewhere there is, there's a plug at the end of it, which um, looks like it plugs into a radio. So this came off.
so that's it, that's the adapter ready. The rest of the area goes up there and the mast goes that way. So this is the section we just made the connector and here it is on the signal keeper. Right, if you saw the um, video I did at um, Spam Point, you would have seen the top section of my antenna was leaning slightly. And that's due to the fact that this is able to move. This is the, the part from the Klansman mast. And it's only fastened here, so it has a bit of give. So there's a bit of play. Yeah? So what I've done. I've, got, I've cut another piece of the same tube that this is made out of and cut a hole in it, uh, cut a slice out of it. So what I'm going to do is that will now oddly, nicely, fit. It's hard to do this one handed, but I'm pushing that just in the gap. between the mast top and the um, rest of the antenna. Now that doesn't move. Now that's solid. So that's a little update to that. So my... I'll just give that another shove in and I need my other hand. My stronger hand to do this. now holding that's now holding everything nice and tight I'm going to push that, that last little bit so that becomes invisible but that is now solid on there so my antenna will be nice and straight next time 